Over on BBC Two at seven o'clock. Plenty more on the programme. On to the weather. Alexa's with us tonight and uh, got very foggy, hard frost, very cold yes, this morning. Yes, bitterly cold in northern parts of the region, minus five Celsius and, as you said, frosty conditions. So let's take a look at your frosty conditions this morning. John Tweddle photographed the early morning dog walker in Emsworth. Paul Nicholson took this picture, um, morning frost in Havant. And Ben Beale took this picture of the cold start to the day in Salisbury with a bit of mist on the water. So through the course of tonight, we're expecting a little bit of a change. More cloud will start to arrive from the south and with it, outbreaks of rain, mainly in the form of showers. And there will be a frost for others, so showers for some, frosty conditions where we do have the clear skies because temperatures under the clear skies are going to still fall away to around freezing or just above. In our towns and cities, the southern coastal counties are lower 3 to 5 Celsius. So that's the theme tomorrow, cloudy conditions, showers rolling up from the south, mainly light and patchy, but we could have the odd moderate or heavy burst at times. Some drier conditions as well to be had and temperatures, despite the cloud and the rain, will struggle. Highs of 6 to 7 Celsius, so a cold feeling day with that northerly wind. So as that northerly wind changes to an easterly wind, we start to draw in the really cold air from the near continent. So through tomorrow night, we're expecting clear skies in places initially, and then a weather front will start pushing in. Once that weather front hits the cooler air that's coming in from the east, we may have some wintry stuff. So maybe a bit of sleet in the forecast, but mainly falling as rain, with temperatures tomorrow night dropping to around 2 or 3 Celsius. So Saturday is set to be a bitterly cold day. We've got that strengthening easterly wind, the cold air coming off the near continent. This area of low pressure will bring some heavy rain at times, which could be quite persistent in places, lasting through much of the day, gradually moving its way eastwards through the course of Saturday evening and overnight into Sunday. So Sunday's the better day of the weekend, but let's take a look at the weekend as a whole, because we are expecting some very heavy rain at times on Saturday, very cold winds in particular through Sunday, and the possibility of wintry showers and maybe a bit of a sleet mixed in with the rain. So let's take a look at the outlook. Tomorrow we're expecting some heavy showers at times. Through Saturday, persistent rain in places. A cold northerly wind on Sunday and colder still next week, Sally. Alexis, thank you very much. Uh, tomorrow, if you can, join us because we're going to be stepping back in time in the classroom, in particular to Roman times, to see how their teaching methods compare with ours today. It will be very interesting. There's more tonight at 8 and then again at 10.30. Thanks for watching this evening. Take care. Bye-bye. Good night.